There you go, you wipe me out. Believe it. Lucky, I thought you were going to get busy with some of that required summer reading. I'm just taking a break, Mom. Dad's here to see you. Hey, let me take Lulu outside. Take her to the sandbox, huh? Hmm. I'm sure she'd like that, honey, but, um, actually... Come on, Lily, come on. Eh, thanks for the dividend of my allowance. You <clears throat> betcha. Come on, Parker. A dividend in his allowance? Jim, penny a point. He's getting too good for me. So, what's up? What's up, that's it? No... Preamble. Okay. Look, um, I don't want Lucky feeling bad, like he broke some federal court injunction or something if he comes to the club to visit me. Well, there's a simple solution to that. Just don't see him there. Laura, I'm proud of that club. I've worked hard. It's a legitimate success. I should be able to share some of that pride with my son. He's underage, Luke. Well, nobody's serving him. <laughs> what do you think? Do you think the cops are going to bust me or something because my kid hangs out there? It's not the cops I'm worried about, and you know it. Why can't he just see you at Ruby's? That's not the same. I'm spending a lot of time at the club. It's a big part of my life now. And what if he needs me, huh? He's supposed to wait till, I, uh, till closing time, 2 a.m.? There's a thing called a telephone. You are being completely unreasonable! I'm sorry. The answer is no. So that's it, huh? Just no? No compromise? I'm not going to compromise his safety. You don't know that he isn't as safe at my place as he is at the schoolyard. Oh, I'm not convinced of that. How do I convince you? You know, I hate to get into the metaphysical here, but it's just a tad difficult to prove that something isn't there. I mean, I look, I see nothing. You look, you see a big fat something. I'm not being unreasonable. This whole exercise was to get me out of the picture. No, that's not... And now, now you're setting up a situation where all I can do is hang out, just hang out out here, all the time, waiting to see my son. And not, not to mention little Lulu. Is that what you really want? Laura, you better take a hard look at what's clanking around in your subconscious, darling. Don't you dare condescend to me. Then get real. I've been dealing with nothing but harsh realities all along. Why don't you get real? Instead of insisting on living this comic book lifestyle where superheroes battle the bad guys and, and the violence consists of these balloons with words like uh, pow and kaboom on them and the hero never gets hurt and his children never get caught in the crossfire. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. For a second there, I thought there were two adults in this room, but I see I was wrong. You know, I, there's no way that I'm capable of being responsible for my kids. And there's certainly no way that I'm capable of having the tender feelings that their mother has for them. I suggest that you leave now. This is my house, too! Don't you forget it! My house! My kids! My dog! My wife! I'm not going to continue this conversation. No, no, you don't. No, 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 you ain't getting away from this. You ain't getting away from this. That's better. I could have knocked. It wouldn't have felt as good. That's a symbolic act, baby. Oh, Laura. I'm so, so fed up with the closed doors. I'm so, I'm so tired of the trumped up obstacles. The fact is you love me. No, no, no. Yes, 
didn't intend for this to happen. You most certainly did. That was the most follow me up the stairs stomp I've seen in a long, long oh, time. Oh, that's purely subjective. You caught me off guard. Baby, your little guard was flashing signals like a hot little firefly on a summer night. A firefly? I know about these things. Well, I'll bet you do, nature boy. Oh, never. No, 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 no. This is just going to make everything so much more difficult. That's what I'm counting on. Oh, don't, don't count on it. This was a major backslide on my part. No question there. I mean, don't think that you can change my mind just by making passionate, wild love to me. I never cross my Lucky can see you at the club in the afternoons as long as I know where he is. It was good, wasn't it? Get dressed. Well, what do you mean? Not even time for a cigarette? You don't smoke. Baby, I would pick up any filthy, nasty habit you asked of me. Go, <laughs> so, hurry up. Come on. I don't want Lucky to get the wrong idea here. <laughs> I couldn't get the wrong idea, Laura. We're married. Because he'll misunderstand this, Luke, and it'll give him false hope. False hope? No. Never. Come on, Dad. Come on. No, no. 